everybody and we're back on the east coast in my favorite city st john's newfoundland we are by the water i did a little excursion from my hotel it's about a 30 minute walk we're at sugarloaf trails i did the shortest one only because i don't know how long it would take me to do the longer ones but it is oh i just can't even describe it, it is so beautiful and the hike was relatively short. It is a little bit rocky, so make sure to wear proper footwear if you check it out. But this was so fun. I think it's like four o'clock right now and there's still plenty of daylight left. So I'm just gonna linger and just savor just how beautiful this is. In comparison to when I was here last, it was freezing cold. And then I was also here in December wearing this exact outfit, but it wasn't as bad. So today it's a little bit milder. It definitely feels more like spring, but it's just so pretty. So um, I will leave a link to this trail down below. So definitely check it out if you're here. It's just so unbelievable how beautiful it is. So I'm just gonna sit here and just be thankful for the beauty that I get to to see when I'm on my layovers like this. And the more I see, the more I'm gonna share with you in this video. So come along and let's see what else we can find. I just wanted to say too that I'm really grateful that I get to share this experience with you and to bring you along on my travels even though you can't physically be here with me I'm glad that I can give you a little visual of what there is to see out there and to just encourage you to get out there and just see everything that's around you and just appreciate what life has to offer because life is too short and you need to just make the most of it and that's the motto that I live by is just spontaneity always just kind of going for the next thing, going on the next adventure, always seeking opportunities to explore and to be curious. The people that I look up to have instilled those values in me, my parents, family members, teachers, employers. So please take this motivation that I'm giving you and get out there and see the beauty that Mother Nature has provided to us to enjoy. Hello lovelies. So I'm back at the hotel now. I just ate some dinner. I made myself a feta quinoa salad for tonight with some honey garlic tofu to die for. Very, very good. Highly recommend just making that at home. Our walk was really good. I took about an hour and a half to two hours after that excursion. I really enjoyed it. As you can see from the footage, it was just breathtaking. It did trickle a little bit after I left, but like overall it was such a beautiful day to hike. I had all my layers on. Shout out to Kakin, my event staffing agency that I work for in Toronto. Uh, yeah, it was a good day. I'm glad I had that opportunity to get out. Just be mindful. I did something that I shouldn't have. I bought myself a portable battery for my phone because my phone has a tendency to just die when it's cold. So I didn't bring that. I don't know why I didn't bring it. I thought maybe my phone at 70% would last the entire time. Thankfully, I got some footage of the excursion, which is great, but, but thankfully I remembered how to get back down. They had markings throughout. You could see the base from where you were standing. So as long as you just kind of maneuvered and looked for the trails, you, it was pretty easy to get back down. I did have a moment where I was scared that I didn't know where I was going, but then I saw people coming up, so I just followed where they came from. So just make sure when you go on those excursions, just wear proper layers, bring a first aid kit, bring an extra battery, water and snacks as well. And always pay attention to your surroundings so that you can easily find your way back should your phone die and you don't have a map. So thank you so much for sticking around on this video. That was a place that I had been wanting to check out for a while. I would saved it on my map since I came last time. Like and comment down below if there's anything you want me to check out for next time. And if you guys haven't already, please subscribe. It really means a lot to my channel and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.